Welcome back everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Wasteland 2 Blind. We're in this lovely prison area, <clears throat> which was, well, we could say overrun, but yeah, more taken over by uh, the Red Scorpion Militia. I believe they're Red Scorpions, right? Well, or they're Rat Scorpions, I don't know. Anyway, yes, we're here and we haven't even met in that. Uh, yet, but yeah, they won't be very nice to rangers, so we can probably expect some shootouts as well. Let's go talk to Red over here. Oh, that's the guy. <clears throat> Wait a second. <laughs> that's the guy that we're uh, talking about. Whoa, what's going on over here? There, uh, he's the one that we're talking about. We have to be careful because he has those automated turrets that would shoot us, but apparently we took some kind of a secret passage through the caves to get him. That's pretty cool. A weathered man appears to be struggling with a piece of scrap metal. Huh? Rangers? How the hell did you get in here? We came in the back way, through the caves. Damn it! I keep meaning to block that off. Got all kind of vermin coming in that way. Well, you're here now, so what do you housebreakers want with an honest businessman? What is your business? I buy and sell scrap metal. If you got any or want any, let's trade. Do you have anything to trade? <clears throat> well, he's just got scrap metal. And he sells it for 10 each, so I don't really know if that's any... If a, that's not really a good deal, is it? <clears throat> it's just, yeah. What do you know about Demonta? What makes you think I know anything about Demonta? Never heard of it. Everyone says Red knows about Demonta. Okay, okay, I've heard of it. It's off to the east, but it ain't easy to get to. Need a rat suit to get through the wall, or you'll fry like a chicken. Get through that what wall? You know, the wall of radiation to the east of here. There's a thin spot a ways northeast of the prison, but you still need rat suits to get through it. How do you find the thin spot? All you gotta do is listen for the Mad Monk's broadcast. They give the coordinates and landmarks so you can find the right spot. Where can we hear this broadcast? <clears throat> Can't really hear it until you get east of the prison, but it gets stronger as you get closer to the wall. Just tune in your radio and you'll hear them loud and clear. Tell me about the mad monks. They're cr the crazy bastards that rule the canyon between here and Demonta. They help traders pass through and keep them safe on the way. Just don't get on their bad side. They'll blow your ass up. <clears throat> Any rat suits up here? Can't say I lay my hands on uh, any just now, but there was a ranger who came... There was a ranger who came through here on his way back from Demonta recently. Baikowski? Something like that. Where is ba Baikowski? Okay. Bunch of rangers arrested him and took him away. I looked for him in that mass grave you rangers dump everybody in after you arrest him. <laughs> just kidding. He's probably just locked up back at the Citadel. Maybe if you ask him real nice and let him out of jail, he'll tell you what he knows. <clears throat> okay, goodbye. So long, rangers. The longer the better. And watch out for my preferred customer welcoming system if you leave my f uh, from my front gate. Um, well, how do we get by the preferred customer system? Heaps of scrap metal bl uh, bake in the sun here. This is either a scrap yard or an avant-garde sculpture garden. Maybe both. <laughs> <clears throat> Excuse me. Oh wait, that's a turret! Um, well there's one there and more over them there, and they're not nice. Now, I assume if I go over there, it'll be fine, and we can just hack that. No, we can't hack that, so never mind. We'll probably go back through the caves. I want to check that, though. Well, it's not locked, or is it locked? No, it's not, so I can perhaps just get it, and the turrets won't shoot at me? No, they won't. Farmer's Diary, part three. Let's see Farmer's Diary, part three, then. Um... Where is it? A mean person said I'm unholy, but I got all the normal holes. Oh, the night terror. <laughs> what the hell? <clears throat> Where is the diary part two? This appears to be the diary of a local farmer. It spends many years. Some of it is written in illegible scrolls. Uh, Sint came home with more rumors that the rangers are leaving. Spend the evening talking it over with the entire household, but despite it all, we know we can't leave, even if worse comes to worst. Hope it's just all rumors. Traveled uh, down to the center today to watch the rangers' final supply carts leave. Heard some boos from unhappy farmers. Felt like joining them, but I don't know... What do they owe us, really? And besides, how bad can things get now? Sure, the rangers are gone, but so are most threats. 
The farms are unified under common goals. We'll keep an eye on, uh, on the old prison. Band together against any raiders. There's too many of us for them to kick up any real trouble. I'm feeling good about the future. The prison still stands abandoned, but for a few junky squatters. I was talking to Farmer John's daughter just the other day. Fool girl didn't take kindly to me calling her dad a fool, but she knows I'm right. He and all his doom sayings about the prison being our doom, even talking about demolishing it. Demolish it? With what? A few raiders been harassing Hamilton's farm out east, but the young fool got a posse together and caught every single last one of them and strung them up along the highway. That'll keep the bad news away for longer. A significant part of the journal is missing after this entry, torn out roughly. Hmm. I wonder if it's the farmers that actually became the, uh... You know, the red scorpions. Probably not. Oops, invalid target. Well, this is... Okay, we're gonna take it. We're gonna take it! Right, so back through the caves we go. These must be some serious gophers that can burn. <laughs> right, off we go. My god, why do they make that noise? <laughs> Alright, off we go. Probably best to uh, reload. We've killed everything in here, but hey, still. One can't be careful enough, right? Right, so where do we go? Where's the exit? Uh, the ed exit is over there. Over here. Off we go. Right, so yeah. It's friends and fun. Man, that thing. Um, and it doesn't do anything in combat, apparently, so, I don't know. All those lovely 8,000 points, and I was kind of hoping it would be of some use to us, but no. Well, I guess that would be horribly overpowered. Well, there was this woman is still dying over here, but I want to find some kind of a cure for her. I don't know even what's wrong with her. Um, right, so... Now we'll just have to go into the town, and they probably won't like us. This pre-recorded message is brought to you by RSM Enterprises, Inc. Was it like before? Valley isn't just about safety. It's about quality of life, too. We have the finest Ooh. farms in the Arizona wastes, with more than enough food to feed everyone who joins us, and cozy little general stores, too. We also have an arrangement with the high pool that assures that we will never run out of water. Truly, there is no place in Arizona more pleasant than Happy Valley. Yeah, I'm sure. I'm Commander Danforth of RSM Enterprises, and I approve this message. There, I didn't fuck it up this time. <laughs> Thank you, Commander Danforth. That was fine. <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> okay, so yeah, they're not gonna be too happy about us here. Because we're rangers, and they don't like rangers. That's an old, uh, gas station. My daddy used to poke me with sticks. Ugh. Who was your daddy? I would actually like to know about that. Right, so this is a town. Do we get any description here? Howdy, folks! Welcome to the RSM General Stores. What used to be the center of a busy town now lies in ruin. The gas station has a small sign and a window. Gone to Demonta. Wait, there was something else. Oh. I thought there was, but apparently not. So what does this guy sell? A balding middle-aged middle man with a bushy mustache and a friendly smile. His apron is as clean and white as fresh snow. How can I help you today? Do you need help? Well now, we've got pretty much everything you could want right here under one roof. Food, water, household, uh, couch, uh, bleh, household goods, clothing, canteens, you name it. I'm sorry though, folks. We only accept Scorpion Scrip here at the general store. No cash or trade allowed. If you want to buy, you'll have to come back with Scrip. <clears throat> what is Scorpion Scrip? That's our local currency. The RSM prints it, and the local employers pay them, uh, their employees with it, and you spend it here. So far, the only employer around here is Jim Orator, over at Orator Farm. So if you want some, you'll have to go f uh, work for him for a while. What's so special about that farm? That's our model farm. I get all my fruits and veggies. What the hell is that guy doing? Look at him. He's bugging out. I get all my fruits and veggies and meat from there. If the rest of Happy Valley is like that when RSM is done with it, then it's gonna be the nicest place in the wastes. What is the RSM? 
<laughs> Guess my employers are a little embarrassed by their real name. Most folks know him as the Red Scorpion Militia, but around here they like to know, be known as RSM Enterprises. A little less alarming for potential customers, I guess. What about the Red Scorpions? They were a gang before, bad as they come, but they've changed their ways, decided to clean up their act and the waste at the same time, and a Happy Valley aims to show the rest of Arizona how things will be once the RSM is running things. What is Happy Valley? That's the RSM's new name for the prison area. I... I'm sure it'll get happier as it goes along. Yeah. Pleasure to serve you. Come back anytime. So pretty on the surface, so rotten at the core. Yeah, this is like, uh, you know, I don't know. North Korea, when you enter, everything is lovely and nice, showing you. Wait, wasn't there something here? No. That's a huge flag. Be sure to tell your friends. You vaguely remember a child's rhyme, it's something about a flag and a nation. Childish notions indeed. Gotta hit something. Uh-oh. What the hell? Please don't! I won't do it again, I promise! Let me at her! Alright, gentlemen, that's enough. She's learned her lesson. Haven't you, Gladys? Yes, Mr. Vanover Bake. It won't happen again, Vanover Bake. Well, I smell a fight. I'm gonna save. Mm-hmm. <laughs> We're gonna kick their asses. A prim little man in a pinstripe suit and wire-rimmed glasses. His mouth is as pinched as a closed purse. You there! Stop where you are! Desert Rangers, eh? I am Assessor of Vanover Bank, and on behalf of the RSM, let me welcome you to Happy Valley. Stay as long as you like, but be aware that you'll have to pay your taxes just like everybody else. Now, how many weapons do you have? What do you care about your weapons? In an attempt to curb violence and the over-proliferation of weapons, the RSM Governing Council has instituted a weapon tax. That will be $100 payable directly to me now. Will you pay it? No. Non-compliance with the tax is against the law. I'm afraid we'll have to confiscate your weapons. Boys! Oh, well, I'm already breaking the law. Oh! Uh, <laughs> Ow. Ow! That actually hurts. <laughs> yeah, I don't think so, boy. What does that guy have? Pistol, that's dynamite. That's some kind of a rifle. Possibly a heavy. Right, so, um, hmm. Might not have been the best idea, but, uh, yeah, let's get that guy. Ow! Friendly fire shit. Right. We need two APs. Uh, yeah, let's get rid of this guy. Whoa. Not enough AP. What? Oh, it's five to shoot. Okay. What's he doing? Ow. Ha, <laughs> weapon jam. Yeah, but this guy's a problem. Oh, bloody hell. Oh, that's a shotgun. Does he have more? Yes, he has more. So we gotta get rid of these guys. Um... Oh, what's there for? That guy has four, um, armor. So that means... That means we miss. Ah, God damn it. Okay. Let's get over here. We can't do that, unfortunately. Well, we'll do full damage. Uh, if we hit, of course. Damn it. Sniper rifle! I want to get rid of that guy first. Not bad, but not enough, unfortunately. Uh, we gotta spread out a little, I think. No! Lost control, damn it. Shoot at that one. No, not that one. Crap. Bloody hell, that's not really gonna do much, is it? Mm, no. Let's shoot him again. What the hell? Is that that green thing? Come and get it, candy ass. Right. Well, I want to get rid of that guy first. Nice. Now let's get rid of this guy. 
<laughs> Holy crap, 123. Jeez. <laughs> Lovely. Ow. No, you don't. <laughs> well, I shot the sheriff. Or should I say, I fought the law. And I won. <laughs> oh, cloth patch, crusty nose ring, diamond earring, diamond earring, and only 18. That's a shotgun coach gun, actually. Not bad damage. Dynamite. Ooh, final assessment. It's, uh... Yeah, very cheap to shoot, but not really that much damage. Hmm. And armor threshold 3, so... Briefcase with handcuffs. Three-headed snake. Two leadership. Not bad. And grip tape. That's very nice. And Angela leveled Copy, up. Copy, Echo One. Echo. Congratulations, Echo One. You know, there's a problem here. We might be starting a war with the Scorpions. <laughs> if we're not at war already. Uh, minus one attack AP. That's actually very nice for that little thing. For this makeshift cleaver. So we're gonna try to do that. Let's attach that. Yes. So now it only uses two APs. And it should be lots better than the sickle over here. Let's compare. More damage. Same hit chance. Uh, slightly less critical chance. And three armor penetration instead of two. Still not great, I guess. But... Uh, should be better. I don't know. We'll see. Okay, so... So everyone should reload. Oh man. Angela leveled up. Four skill points. Probably more in hard ass. Yeah, I think so. Just in case we need it. This would be nice as well, but oh yeah, I would need more in weaponsmithing. I should have put it in there. Doesn't she have weaponsmithing as well? No, she's got perception and smart ass, okay. Yeah, that's not a bad uh, energy weapon, but it's got the same armor threshold, and, I mean, the mason cannon will just do more damage in the long run, then. It's also got double the range, so, yeah, not really worth it, I think. Right, so that, uh, that went well. <laughs> What's over here? Can't go in here. Is there something over here? We haven't actually checked this area completely, even though this is a dead end, but I want to check it anyway. Okay, so there's nothing here. I'm just waiting for the, uh... Perception to kick in and find something. Well, that was a nice start. They'll sure uh, welcome us with open hands now, won't they? I'm hoping that the game doesn't go the... You know, usual game logic way. Oh, you've killed someone important. Now everybody knows that you did. That. Um, I'm hoping not everyone will know. Can't imagine why anyone would want water from this well. Especially with the smell of chemicals in the air. Well, it doesn't look like a bad water well. But, yeah. Wonder where that's all coming from. So. This <clears throat> oh, here we go. To you by RSM Enterprises, Inc. This is Commander Danforth of the Red Scorpion Militia. You're about to trespass on Red Scorpion territory. Oh. Turn around immediately. Trespassers will be shot and fed to my dogs. <laughs> Desert Rangers will be fed to my dogs alive. <laughs> there we go. Uh, but if you are instead a potential host, <laughs> or interested in viewing one of our attractive farming lots, please come see us at the RSM Enterprises rental office. Securely located just inside the prison. Thank you. Great. Wonderful. Wait a second. What do you have that? Okay, there we go. Friends are fun. Please, do you have any scorpion script you can spare? A bone thin man, sickly looking and hungry, stares blankly at the ground. Ugh, look at him. Please, I'm starving. I just need a little scorpion script to buy some food. We don't have any scrip. How about some scrap to buy food? Nope. You might be able to live like uh, a king elsewhere with that, but here it's worthless. Cyril only takes strip from his uh, for his food. A scrip. I got three scrip working all last week. It wasn't enough to buy food. How much is the food? Three. <laughs> what? 
300 script for an ear of corn. Cyril called it infatuation. Or was it flatulence? Inflation? I don't know. I don't understand any of it. It don't make sense to me. This rumble in my stomach is the only thing that makes sense. So wait, he made three script working all week. And to buy food, it's 300 script. What the hell? Why don't you work for more? It ain't honest work. They say they'll pay, sure, but every day there's some fee, shovel rental fee, drinking water fee, looking pathetic and making them laugh at you fee. That one was just insulting and uncalled for. I didn't need that. A man needs to have some dignity. That's why I'm begging now. I'd leave town if I were you. An honest man can't leave in this, uh, live in this part. What a lovely place. Well, we'll continue next time. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.